I now present to you Ethan Soltz. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for joining me here today. I'm Ethan Soltz and you're watching XD001. I have a great show for you today as we are going to be opening these right here. Some uh, Halloween themed Pokemon packs. Trick or Treat. I got one of the ones from last year, the originals, and 10 of the newer ones. Let's see what kind of uh, spooky pulls we can get. But first, a deep Pokemon thought for you. In the world of Pokemon, you have Pokemon evolving, the concept of evolution. However, in that same world, you have Pokemon like Arceus, who are the creators of life and everything. God type Pokemon. So you have both the concept of evolution and the concept of a god. Seems a little contradictory to me. Now on to the opening. Okay, yes, this is what we have right here. Um, let's just start with just the one from last year. So, I, you know, there's nothing like crazy to pull in, in these things. They're kind of just fun and cool. So here we go. We got uh, a Mewtwo, Ariados, and Sinistee. Ugh. Okay, so I guess we'll just put uh, holes right there. I uh, I do profoundly apologize as this video is coming out. First off, a day late. It's on a Thursday instead of a Wednesday. But also, it's not even coming out on Halloween or before Halloween. It's, um, I can explain that one. I just, I'm a very schedule oriented person. You know, I really like that Murkrow. It's kind of my favorite pull, actually. Look at that. All the Murkrow. All around it, baby. This is our hollow, though. Chandelure. Chandelure hollow. So we'll set that guy over there. Yeah, I just, uh, I like for my videos, uh, you know, coming out on the day I wanted them to. Which this one came out late, but I wasn't going to let it be early just because it was a. Uh, Halloween. I think do that for the card tricks now. There's one in the back. I hope everyone had a great uh, Halloween though. Uh, possibly you were just chilling at home giving candy to trick or treaters. Maybe you went to a party. Got fucked up. I don't know. I don't know. I didn't go to a party. I stayed home. My mom. My mom. She's very sweet. God bless her soul. She always makes a fun Halloween dinner for all of us. I don't know if you guys. Uh, do that festive fun stuff, but she made hot dogs, wrapped them in little strings of dough, kind of Gengar, right there, I like that. I just dropped it. And then uh, she put like dots of ketchup on it, so it made a mummy dog, a mummy dog, you know, it's Halloween themed. So, uh, then she made like pumpkin uh, smoothies, it was, it was fucking divine. Okay, got Drift Blim. I love Sinnoh so much, so much. Haunta. Houndoom, very cool, very cool. I like, I like that. You know, it's nice, you can get like a whole pack of these fuckers for like, I don't know, 15 bucks or something, then you get a ton of packs. I, I actually didn't give any of these, any of these with trick-or-treaters. I, uh, I did that last year. Last year I bought these packs to give them to trick-or-treaters. Happy Ghastly. The Snore Marcino, baby. And, um, I also bought full-size candy bars last year and the end of year prior to that because I just thought about how um, as a kid it was those amazing memories being like oh my god this house gave me a full-size candy bar everyone's saying go to that house go to that house well I wanted this to be that house but I, I don't know what it is with my neighborhood but it just ain't the same as when I was a kid no no one like fucking showed up there were uh, a few people but we had a lot of leftover ooh duplicate we had a lot of leftover uh, full-size candy bars so it was you know it was uh Interesting. That was an interesting outcome of the whole thing. But, uh, yeah, no, there were there really weren't a whole lot of uh, trick or treaters. You know, this. I'm not gonna lie. This is kind of. I mean, this is neat. This is neat. We're kind of just enjoying uh, some kind of pulls we're getting. I guess there's really no uh, no goal. These things. I love this concept though. Trick or treat. It's fun. I like festivities. They give me a reason to wake up in the morning and just live. Yeah. Okay, Miss Magius. Really neat artwork. I would like to see that in a hollow, actually. Another dozen. We're, uh, we're doubling up. Look at those spirits. Kind of reminds me of a. Uh, today I watched a South Park episode on Scientology, where uh, they were explaining how uh, 
like what Scientologists believe in and like there were these spears floating around it kind of makes me think of that they also kind of look like like sperm like sperm cells or sperm you know uh, so they yeah you know that's just what they look like <clears throat> I love South Park to anyone watching who uh, like South Park strongly recommend watching uh, Trapped in the Closet the episode about Scientology Fucking hilarious. Tom Cruise won't come out of the closet, literally. Okay. Sinus tea. Black tea Pokemon. Hound Yeah, we're doubling up a lot. Uh, but what do you expect with these things? I you know, it just is what it is. Trick or trade. Final pack. It is the final pack, ladies and gentlemen. Excuse me. I have enjoyed my time here with you today. I really want to thank you for tuning in. I hope everyone is uh, living good at the moment. I hope everyone had a great Halloween. I hope everyone is excited for Thanksgiving, spend time with their family. I hope you have some cool stuff coming up in your lives to look forward to. Um, my brother's getting married in a few days, which is fucking bizarre. My older brother, who we used to open Pokemon packs, you know, as, uh, as kids. Used to open Pokemon packs as kids, the EX era, Diamond and Pearl era. Just go nuts whenever we pull an EX or level X. And now he's getting married. The times are changing. The times are uh changing, as Bob Dylan would say. So, this one's for him. This one's for you, Corey. Hopefully, I get a Pikachu. If I get a Pikachu, then uh, that blesses his new marriage. But good luck. Okay. Well, let's see what happens. Got a shup it. It's a good sign. Poltergeist. Chandelure. So I, I can't bless my brother in his new marriage with uh, luck. It's, you know, it's, uh, it's the thought that fucking counts, baby. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for joining me here today. I am Ethan Soltz. You're watching XD001. And I want you to have a good day.